We are now hearing for the first time from the Jaguar who has become the team's most famous new dad, Dewan Smoot. Yeah. In case you missed it, early Tuesday morning, the defensive pass rusher rushed to deliver his newborn daughter in the family's living room. Today, News for Jack Sports anchor Jamal St. Cyr got a chance to visit with the happy parents. Jamal, what a great story. It's a is. really great story. This story getting a lot of attention. Dewan really excited that he got to talk to NFL Hall of Famer Michael Strahan this morning about this story. Ooh, so a cool moment for him there as well. Damon Smoot has some quick hands on the football field, but his hands may be even quicker off the field. On Tuesday, he had to jump into action in his living room when his wife went into labor. From rushing the field in London after the Jaguars' first win of the season to delivering his daughter at home. This would be a week the Smoot family will never forget. And, um, I, I, I Honestly, I haven't even had time to even process the emotion. On Tuesday morning, Dewan Smoot helped his wife, Amara, deliver the couple's second child. Dewan's Jaguars teammates said they aren't surprised that something like this would happen to him. Bro, out of all people, it would happen to Smoot. That is the perfect person to happen to. So when I heard the story, I thought he was like, bro, you just BSing, bro. You just trying to sound like a movie. So the fact that it happened, that was, that's a cool little story. Well, this isn't a story from a movie. It really happened. The baby's out. Okay. On Tuesday morning at around 4 a.m., the couple was heading out the door for the hospital when Dewan's wife, Amara, fell. He was able to catch her, and he delivered their daughter, Alani Moon, right there in the couple's living room. It, basically, we didn't really have time to even, like, call her. I mean, call, call 911 at all. Dewan said he was partially prepared for the situation because the couple had their two-year-old son, Amir, through a planned natural birth at home. So it, 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 it just felt like, you know, felt comfortable because we already did it before, you know. So when she did come, it was like, all right, we just need to make sure that she's breathing. Dewan was able to calmly follow directions from the paramedics over the phone, but he was caught by surprise when they told him he needed to find a shoestring. I had no idea that shoestring could even be used for that. <laughs> when she told me that, I was like, what do we need a shoestring for? She's like, for the umbilical cord. I'm like, okay, let me, let me find some shoes. And good thing my shoe collection is like right, right next to us or whatever in the, in the other room. So I went and go grab some shoes and I tore it out as quick as possible. And um, <laughs> I was just kind of panicking, like, where, where should I put it? Like, is it sterile? Like, what, what should I do with it? And she, she just walked me through, was like, just, just um, clamp it about six inches from it from the baby to make sure that, you know, the blood flow is going to the baby. Just make sure that uh, everything's good. So, hey, had to jump in action. <laughs> While this whole situation was unfolding, the couple's two-year-old son, Amir, was just calmly sitting on the sofa throughout the whole event. Amir was most excited about the chance to ride a fire truck to the hospital. And keep in mind, this whole situation happened less than 24 hours after Dewan returned from London. He said that was actually a good thing because he was actually still awake because of the time change. Tom, Mary?